Nowadays it is an absolute rarity that Harper makes new GSE or any form of accessories for a Scale 500 airport setup. So when they do it, we of course have to take a closer look. With that hello and welcome to a new episode of review where we instead of taking a look at a brand new aircraft model today we'll take a look at the brand new jet blast deflectors or jet blast fences of helper wings the box itself we can see is a fairly simple plastic box where we can see the product from the front side then there's a little piece of cardboard where we on the back side have these uh, deflectors printed on and apparently there are three different types in this uh, box so let's take a closer look at them to see if they are actually any good so there they are, the brand new Jet Blast fences from Helper Wings in scale 500. But what does this really mean in this case? Well, when we look at the dimensions of these pieces, each individual piece has a length of 2 cm, a depth of 4 mm and a height of 8.5 mm. Furthermore, they are entirely made out of plastic and according to the box, there should be three different types of fences. Female, male and male on the very real possibility that I am not up to the mental challenge of identifying three different types of fences here, I can very easily identify the female fences and the male fences as each male fence has a little knob on the left side. But other than that, I just don't see what the third piece of fence should be. But in any case, the fences work rather nicely and the little function of being able to stick them together does also work very well. So there we have it, the brand new Jet Blast fences from Harper Wings since scale 1 to 500. Now this is not the first time that Harper has made Jet Blast fences, but the older and much smaller versions of them were never sold separately, but only as part of a accessories set. Now you can finally buy Jet Blast fences from Harper Wings in an individual set. But of course it is far from the only option out there if you want to buy Jet Blast fences. There are plenty of people offering those, many of them in 3D print. But what I can say about these Jet Blast fences from Harper Wings is that the finish is actually very, very nice. The simple but very effective system of sticking them together works just perfectly. And when we look at the size of these Jet Blast fences, perhaps for an individual piece being two centimeters in length is a little bit too long for my taste. But when we place them next to an aircraft model, I would definitely say that the height is just perfect and overall the look is actually pretty good. And with an official retail price from Harper Wings of 12 euros 95 for 20 fences, I would actually say that this is a rather fair price. So yeah, if you haven't already covered your needs for Jet Blast fences, then I would say this is actually a pretty good alternative compared to some of the 3D printed options you can find, for example, on eBay. So absolutely worth having for your airport. Now with that we have reached the end of today's episode. If you have enjoyed this video then don't forget to leave a like, that would be very much appreciated and of course if you are new around here why not hit subscribe, that would be absolutely awesome. With that I'd like to say thank you very much for watching, hope to see you soon again, I'm checking out and bye.